What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Justin Falls. We back at it again with another video, and today we are looking at the ASUS ROG Ally case. So this is the travel case. I'm gonna start taking it out of the box now. Um, it ain't much to it to unbox, and there it is. Inside is just a, like a little plastic sleeve. It wasn't even in this plastic sleeve when I opened it. But yeah, that's the box. Nothing on the back really. Um, and here it is. It will fit your ROG and I think it would also fit the charging port as well. I would hope so. Got a manual in here. You see right here, it's the inside is nice and soft. Nice and plush. You got some slots here for your uh, memory cards and stuff like that. I would assume. Whatever other little accessories you got. And then it has these little um, indents for the actual control sticks. Let me go grab the allies and, and toss it in there. Okay, now I have here with me the ally stand, the ally itself, and the charger. Let's see if we can fit all of this in there. Um, I feel like they went with a very like uh, minimalist kind of approach with this thing. I guess you gotta lay it down like this, or like this. It looks like it's upside down, like I, like I have it upside down. Cause the little grooves are in different positions. So, let's put it this way. Oh, it's cutting on. Look like it's supposed to go this way. Put this over the screen to protect it. And you just close it up like that. It doesn't have any like, it does have these little, uh, these little tags here. I guess you could hook, hook it on to something like a carabiner or whatever. Um, it seems like a pretty, it doesn't really feel like a premium case. I feel like they kind of just, do this together and slap the ROG logo on it. And I'm, I'm really confused as to how you would, how they expect you to open this up. You're supposed to open it up like this. I guess you're supposed to open it up like that. I don't know if you're supposed to um leave this down or put this up or, or what. <laughs> it's a little bit of a confusing case, I'm not gonna lie. A little bit of a confusing case. You, you can't even, doesn't even look like you can fit the stand in there with it. Let me see what, like, there's no way for you to put anything else in there other than the thing, other than the, uh, the, the ally, and then maybe some SD cards or something in this pocket. You definitely can't, you definitely cannot fit this charger in there. You definitely cannot fit this charger in there. There ain't no way you're fitting it in there. Um, so that's, I mean, for $40, it's not really that, ex it's really not that expensive, but I'm surprised that, you know, they, they, sold us you know just this kind of look like last minute put together case <laughs> it's kind of um i'll be honest it's kind of silly looking it's kind of silly like uh you know like for the steam deck at least they gave you a nice hard shell case i think i have the steam deck case over here somewhere this is the pre this is the yeah, this is the pre-order case for the steam deck it has a place for your charger kit and it has a full mold of the Steam Deck. Like, give me a second. I'm just gonna show you. There's a full. There's a full mold of the Steam Deck. A full. A full mold, and you get a cleaning cloth with it. This, and this came free with the pre-order. This came free with the pre-order when you order the, when you order the uh, the high spec one, the one that's like, well, like six fifty. And then this one is six ninety nine. Doesn't come with a case. And you can't even fit anything else in there other than maybe some cards or something like that. Like some SD cards or something like that. You can't even fit the stand that they gave you. And you definitely can't fit the charger. That's very disappointing. I'm not going to lie. I'm disappointed in Asus with this. They need to put out a better case. Now, granted, it was only $40. So it's like, come on. I know some of you are going to say, come on, man. What do you expect for $40? But it's like, come on, bro. They could have did a lot better than this. 
it looked like they focused on aesthetics more than like the ability for you to carry stuff with it because you you have to you need space in whatever bag you're carrying this in to put the charger and the uh, RG Allo. Let's say you just wanted to take this outside and you have like a smaller naps, you have a, like a smaller bag or your bag is full, you don't really have a lot of space left in it. How are you gonna, where are you gonna put the charger? Where are you gonna put the the, this, this, the little stand if you if you feel like taking it? You know, I feel like that's, that's a missed opportunity there for Asus. They did put out that, I will give them credit, they did put out that power brick with the, uh, with the USB, the two USB inputs and the HDMI, but that's what this should have been. That's what this thing right here should have been. To be honest, I know I'm going on a rant and this is just by the case, but this case made me think like, yo, they, Asus kind of dropped the bag, dropped the ball there with this, with this case here. Cause I, I really don't even know if I would even use this little pocket here for anything at all. Anything at all. Like the way the grooves are set up, you, you have to put it this way. So when you're opening it, you got to face it away from you, zip it out and pull it down. That's kind of kind of weird kind of weird whereas the steam deck the steam deck one you just kind of boom open it up it's very intuitive this is a very hard show case I, I wouldn't be afraid to drop it um yeah like look at this case and then look at this case bro like come on it's night and day bro it's night and day like that that this this rgi case it sucks now granted 40 dollars you get what you pay for but I mean, now that I'm thinking about it, I don't know, Asus. I think y'all did bad on this one. Y'all kind of did bad on this case. Y'all could do way better than this. Y'all, Asus, come on now. Now, there's been a lot of quality control issues with their other products. A lot of Jay's Two Cents and oh, what Gamers Nexus called them out on it. Even Linus called them out on it. And don't get me wrong, the RG Ally is a great product on its own. But it's like... You need to pair this premium product with some premium accessories. Like this is this is kind of ridiculous. It's kind of ridiculous. I'm not gonna lie. I'm very disappointed in this in this case. When I got it, it came in this huge box. I'm thinking that it's gonna be way bigger than it actually was, but it's not. It's kind of crazy, man. So y'all, let me know what y'all think about this RG Ally um, carrying case. It's forty dollars. You can get it from GameStop. It does not fit your charger. It does not fit your stand. It has little storage pockets for your SD cards, but I don't even think you would, I don't, I don't see any use case for that. If you have a use case for it, let me know. So y'all let me know in the comments. So y'all already know the vibes, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. It's your boy just falls and we out, one.